I now want to discuss the subtraction of vectors. If we have the same vectors a and b, and c now equals a minus b, then it should not come as a surprise that a minus b equals ax minus bx in the x direction plus ay minus by in the y direction plus a of z minus b of z in the z direction. So this is the x component of the vector c, this is the y component, and this is the z component of the vector c. We can also see that in a geometrical way, to get some feeling for it, what it means to subtract vectors. And again, I will take a two-dimensional case, it's easier to see, and for simplicity I will take the vectors only in the y and the x plane. But what I do holds in general, also in three dimensions. So we have now here the y-axis, and we have the plus x-axis, the origin, plus y-axis. Let this vector be A, and let this vector be B. And we want to know what the vector C is, which is A minus B. Now I can construct a parallelogram by drawing this line from B to A, draw a parallel line through the tail of B, draw a parallel line through the tip of A, parallel to B, and where these two intersect, this is now my vector C, which is A minus B. You can easily see this in a different way. You can see that this is indeed correct. I can think of this subtraction as the following. C plus B equals A. So the question now is, which vector do I have to add to B, namely the vector C, to get A? Well, you see immediately that if I add this vector to this vector, following the rules of the adding of vectors, making a parallelogram, that this vector A is the sum of B and C. It's one way of doing it. Another way of doing it is saying, aha, C is also A plus minus B. So minus B is this vector, the same as this one that 180 degrees flipped over. Now I have to add this vector to A to find C. Well, there we go. I make a parallelogram. There we go. And where do I end up? Right here. So notice that the sum of this vector and this vector, according to the summation rules, indeed give me this vector. And so this is a nice way of sort of seeing in your head geometrically what it means when you subtract vectors.